Hi traders, I'm JTrader. Live lesson on how to long and short small caps. SBFM small cap around 4 million float went from 2 until $10 in few days. So look at this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel to not lose any kind of lesson and see you in the room. All right, we have a micro flow stock around uh, 6 million float. Flow rotated around uh, already multiple times. Uh, cancer news. We have over here some daily levels, but without any kind of importance because there was almost no volume traded. So I'm starting to look at the chart from uh, uh, this peak over here. This was a couple of weeks ago. Uh, we had a big push. This was a top into the 930s. Then over here, you can see some high volume days. We had over here some peaks. So we can put these levels. We can refer now to the daily chart. So we have that five over there. Let's see if we have some other important levels. We can put this high, but then really nothing anymore. So we have five, 650 and 930. Uh, we don't have a huge amount of volume above over here, 650. Uh, this morning, I'm not uh, for now short bias. As I said yesterday on PLX and Aether, actually, sorry, PLX, and uh, we were looking at RCAD. The volume is a very important um, parameter. High volume, multiple flow rotation in pre-market. Remember that the float is below 7 million. So we have already almost four times over here flow rotation. This means that at the open, unless we stuff into this area, golden zone and pre-market high, I'm not looking to short this. So this means that if we stop over here, so blow up, okay, then I can short risking this eye, looking for the J lines one and then five minute J lines. Instead, if we have morning dip, starts curl, I'm longing, looking for a squeeze and generally they halt over here. And then above the pre-market eye, I'm looking to buy dips, right? So again, the setups are the same. Really, market doesn't change. Uh, so I'm looking for these possibilities. Now I'm almost looking to long over here. I like this inside, inside bar formation. You see it, right? So I'm personally uh, small red for the morning on uh, SBFM. Uh, I took a few scalps, but kept very small. Uh, one break even, one five, six cents stop. And I decided to wait on SBFM uh, to take longs or other things. Uh, the point for me is looking at Jalen's dip or pre-market high 650 short. That is what I'm looking for. So some dip and volume over here on SBFM. I bought the dip. So got in field 601 risking just this uh, uh, 595 over here. Why? I see volume, I see the heat map, I see the trend line break. So why not to take this trade with a very tight risk? Now 609, I'm putting my stop break even, you see? We have a seller 609. If we remove, we're going to shoot. You see the heat map went away, right? So probably he's buying now on the ask. Let's see if we can remove 09, otherwise stop break even. And I'm not afraid to take cuts, break even, or anything else. 09, we still have the seller removed finally. We have 10. I'm ready in the money now. So get back, get back over here, nine on the ask. And I know that in pre-market we'll have like uh, pumpers on this trying to push it up, right? See the big uh, buyer came from six, jumped to 10. I don't know if you're watching the table, it's very important. Uh, some dark pools, 9999, uh, 0701. This is that big player over there at nine. So 10, 11, they're trying, I'm still holding. And now back below the nine, you see? Over, under, over, under that level. So the important area here on this one is the 09. I'm ready always with my fingers on break even. Archon, let's see if we're gonna have 150. Remember for today, 150. 
on Twitter doing the same thing, basically. Okay, now 10 again, and then back below nine. So we have a big seller each time at nine, see it? So I have a first sell over here at 13 right now. So SBFM, SBFM, we long at 0304. Uh, risk in the money, first sell. So now I'm holding over here at 25. I'm going to sell a little bit more at 26. So I started from a small trade, uh, was going like, you know, for five, six cents. Now it's becoming a good trade. So SBFM over here. Now they're accelerating. They're looking for the breakup, right? So we're going to see for this pushing. Morning, Russ. 630 looking everybody's looking for a breakup but a lot of short sellers over here personally i'm still holding long half position right now 30 over here in the ask there we are 33 remember at this point you have a lot of short sellers also breakout traders let's see who's stronger seems like a breakout traders getting a little bit more failed over here the 38 got filled yes so selling more 38 so you see this is basically trading without pumping buying volume momentum stocks anybody follow me here to learn just don't copy the trades don't follow the alerts look how we trade okay you're here to learn how to day trade and that's the most important thing so again traders I recorded this, I recorded the first part, our plan, the pre-market over here on SBF, SBFM. Uh, I'm going to also upload this on, uh, on our room after, in our YouTube channel probably. I think this is a very good trade. Uh, you can spot how we did it, and you can learn from this. Let's grab something long over here, SBFM 14. I'm going to see a push, rip, selling partial, and then it will short to the top extension. Selling over here, 21 partial. Want to see more rip to the 30s? Got filled 21. Open. Let's see the rip. Selling 29, selling 30. Selling 40. Sold all. So super fast trade for me. I'm watching our comment. Yeah. Dip now, SBFM, I recycle long. And selling into the rip again, second time. So uh, super fast traders doing this. Doing this two times, buying dip selling, buying dip selling. Okay. Yeah, I can't good, but I want to stick on SBFM. Okay. SBFM, not touching yet. Twitter, dip into the Zaylands and long. Hope you took it. So dip long SBFM per plan. In Twitter, dip J lines on the overlong. Avoiding to trade for now, uh, SBFM short, too much high volume. SBFM, I believe, will go around seven. So waiting over here, patience, patience, patience. Okay. You need to do, you do not meet, you don't need to make money in the first five minutes. We already at Twitter, if you took it, and SBFM with me over here. SBFM dip. Bought some dip on SBFM at 06, risking over here 99. Selling at 16. SBFM is paying the bills today. Holding was not break even SBFM. Out all SBFM, the rest in the money. So again, took another one. Watching for another dip. Traders, 10 minutes trading. We took. Uh, the long on uh, Twitter, we took uh, two longs on SBFM. Perfect. I just relong on SBFM right now. 19 average. Want to sell on the rip. 28 now. Selling partially 30. Selling at 34. Selling in more at 41. Three long this morning on SBFM. Now we're waiting for the breakout. 50 again. You can see the volume increasing. Anybody long with me on SBFM? Selling the 50 more. 
want to see you guys taking this longs okay beautiful rip let's hold some let's hold trailing at 6 30 right now all my calls i give you as soon as i get in j lines pattern with our j line curl up long let's see for more rip 70 is in my goals 50 refilling you can see 50 50 50 coming so we have a big seller at 60. out all right now so i'm done with this for the morning i want to see some traders over here doing the longs with me so we had one two three four wins longs so sbfm so we're along the dip over here, 35, 36. You can see this level, yellow line. Uh, also heat map over here. Selling partial now, 43. Selling more, 44. Risking break even. Out. So super fast one. Now, if we have another fake washout, and we can see a clear uptrend line, right? If I see these traders, we'll jump in long again. Uh, Twitter possible short coming up anybody following the longs on sbfm with me all morning on this long again over here right now sbfm not difficult just need a little bit of practice like video games so that 30 is my risk i want to see a reclaim of 40 and then i will sell really partial buyer 30 buyer went well done chad Careful, a trend line break. Out. Don't stay over here because can possible wash. So I took a stop of this, the first stop that I had on SBFM. Rejoin long over here, SBFM. Using always tight stops. So looking for the support always at 26. Seller at 39.40. Selling partial 37, got filled. So now stop break even. Want to see a rip in the volume? Look in this trend line, right? You need to see a break over there. New five minute bar. Out. Out because I'm always afraid for a possible wash. So super quick over here. Uh, but again, cannot complain about the morning. Actually, before when I said I'm stopped out. I got a win, but uh, I consider that a scratch. You can see over here, long, long, and then out, okay? So trying to buy the dip, selling the pops, buying the dip, selling the pops. Basically, don't fucking short this, please. Only blow up at highs, not lows, or you get skinned. No? You don't want to get skinned, right, buddy? And there we are, the move. Nice trend line break. Now looking for a support in the 40s. So I micro-longed over here, SBFM at 38. Selling at 43 partials. Want to see a rip of around 50, 55. Then I can sell more, otherwise break even. Out. So micro, micro, micro position. And... Uh, it's hard to, I mean, it's hard to lose on this if you know how to read the tape. So the point is, am I going crazy over here looking at this three-way pattern? The volume is a huge high flow rotation, so you will never need to short this unless we have a blow up of volume. And this is a typical over here, morning consolidation with the highs of the pre-market. So you're going to short simply thinking this will go down. All right, we have to wait for fake outs. Remember for stuffs, fake outs. Okay, makes sense. Yeah. Jake, Ito, Manusen. Well, let's continue to watch this. It's pretty lateral right now, choppy. Yeah. So I see our main support at 620. Now this level down here, you can see also the heat map down here, right? 620. You're forming a small wedge. 
There we are. Start looking for the 650. If it's tough, 650, 660. I'm looking to short over here. Level of transaction would be the 650, 660 on SBFM. Focus now on the tape, five minutes. When I say tape, you can either focus only on bookmap, right? This could be a good spot over here, 650. 46. Don't be tempted. Respect the rules. Respect your timing. Respect your levels. Respect the setups. Remember that hesitation is as bad as FOMO, right? So unfortunately, I wanted to record the last piece. And uh, I said, look for the 660 fake out. And I said over here, stuff 650, 650. I was recording. And then I closed one second the connection. If somebody took this stuff, that's a stuff that you want to see. Totally predictable. I told you, we killed it. Mary missed it. Mary, take a run today, okay? Five miles. Next time, you won't miss it. So get along, sold the pop 650, short and 660, short of 640, add over here, boom. Now holding over here, half. You had to get him this morning, buddy. Early there were. Beautiful. Okay, now let's hold. 